Hello there chums, this is I, Captain Stephen Exo, and in my previous live stream, a gentleman joined the live stream called Elliot, and he told us of a way of getting uni units, like really, really easy units. So yeah, I put a little link up there to that live stream, and yeah, a little thank you to Elliot uh, in advance. Uh, we're going to see if this actually works. So step one is to clear down your inventory, so I need to... Put a lot of my stuff into storage for now. The storage has been greatly, greatly increased. So that's not a problem. I think I put that in my freight today. And we'll just chuck all this over into there. I want to keep that though. Because that's quite good for dangerous planets. Yep, so I'll be right back with you after I've cleared down my inventory. Alright, see you in a bit. Alright, next step is get yourself to the station. And up inside a station, you can sometimes find navigational data laying about on tables. It would look like a little flat disc, or it would be like an orange or a uh, blue cube. Let's just have a quick look around, see if we can spot any for you. And trust my luck, nope, I can't see any of them laying about up here right now, chums. But yeah, normally you'd find navigational data. Sometimes it can be on the counters as well. A little flat disc or an orange or blue cube. And when you have got navigational data, it looks like this. So, yeah, you can also find it on planet surfaces sometimes, Chum. So I just got all these from my um, hostile planet. Um, yeah, but yeah, anyway, so here we go. I've got my navigational data. So the next step is to go over to the cartographer. Now, at the moment, I've had this as suggested as a um, sort of bit of a an exploit, if you like. I don't know whether it is or isn't. I haven't tried it yet. This is the first time I'm trying it. So you go over to the cartographer. Now apparently you buy maps off of him, but he doesn't take your navigational data. So I had like, what, 16 navigational data? So here we go. Um, per uh, exchange maps. Here we are. And I want all of these. So there we go. So I'd, uh, let's just go up to what I've got, which I believe is 16. There we are, we'll have all of those. Thank you. And then you can just keep doing it over and over again. Look at that. So even if I did only have one or two navigational datas, I could just do this. And that's why you need to empty out your infantry, because you're just going to get a shed load of cartography maps. So here we go. Let's just keep going. Alright, I'll be back with you once I've got a shed load of maps, chums. Okay, okay. Chums. well look at this. I've just gone down to the last amount. Let's see if we can just do it on the other stack. Let's see if I've still got my 16. It looks like it has, because it hasn't gone red. So there we are. And we can get all these ones. So I'm just going to make my way all the way down this whole list, chums, until I ever run out of space or something goes wrong. So yeah, I'll be right back with you once I've bought all of these cartography maps and we're going to see how many units we get for them. This is rather cheeky. This is going to get patched rather imminently. So if you want to exploit this, you might want to get it on it sooner rather than later. Okay, well, here we go. I've got no free slots left now. So let's um, go and see if I can sell all this. I'm going to get 64,000 units per stack. Not bad, not bad at all. Is it all going to it's even got into my expanded cargo chums. Right, okay, well let's go sell this and see how much units I get for all of that. Uh, sorry little guy, didn't mean to interact with you. Right, so we are now selling. Let's uh, go down to cartography maps, let's sell all these. So yeah, I'm going to get 3.1 million units. Don't mind if I do. Okay, well this is this is a fantastic little mini exploit. Uh, but yeah, that's that's all of those. And I can sell all of those as well. Not bad. I mean, it's it's not the most fun way to make units, I have to say. Um, but yeah, yeah. Well, that's thanks to Eric who joined in uh, my live stream the other day. In fact, I think he's changed his name now on YouTube. So let me just get you his real name on YouTube, just so I can give a proper credit where credit's due. Okay, chums. Once well, second. his name is Eclipso SOS Eclipse SOS eighty one. So yeah, I'd put it, the actual spelling of his name just up there as well. And a link to his video, because he's actually got a video up now. I mean, he only put it up 20 hours ago, so after he told me, it looks like he's put a video up of his own. It's only 40 seconds, <laughs> so he does it in, in a lot quicker time than what I've managed to. But there we go, so that's Eclipse SOS81. Um, okay, well, thank you very much, and yeah, I've subscribed to him. I'm his second subscriber. Yeah, you could be the third. You could be the third. Yes, I'm talking to you. Go take a look. Hopefully you'd have more tips in future. All right, guys. Well, that's that's everything for me. So, yeah, that's a bit sneaky, isn't it? I have got another sneaky idea. My other sneaky idea would be to be use portal codes. 
and use the portal code to go to a planet where there's a crashed ship, like an S-Class hauler. I think there is a code on one of Zane's videos, in fact, that will take you to said ship. In fact, I'll put a little link up there to, to that, um, yeah, that ship location. But what I'm thinking is if you just repair the um, drive and take it off, take it to the station, I'm fairly sure you're going to get quite a lot of units for it. I don't know how many. I'm going to have to check it out myself and see if it does actually work. It's just a theory at the moment, a working theory, but hopefully I'll be able to put a video together. Anyway, until next time, hopefully I'll be bringing that to you guys and seeing whether it is an exploit to be had. Cheery bye for now. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Yes, I have a Patreon. Hop on over to Patreon. There's a tier there for pretty much everyone, including ship models. And yes, thank you to all my Patreons that you can see here. Thank you, Patreons! And yes, I also have merch. Yeah, hop on over, grab yourself a funky mug or some awesome socks. And yeah, Nerf, no, thank you very much for making the music for my videos, chum. You're awesome. And yeah, if you want to support me in another way, you can just do the normal stuff, which is hit the notification bell, a like or a subscribe, or write a comment. Comments are freaking awesome. Yeah, and yeah, uh, or stay with me a bit longer. Watch a bit more Captain Steve and Exo. Bye-bye.